We'll guide you through how to fix a wireless keyboard not working. We're keeping this guide broad so you can follow along with your wireless keyboard as well. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So we've got some different fixes we can try. So first of all, come on to wireless keyboard. What you want to do is make sure that it's definitely turned on and you can also try restarting it as well. So on this keyboard here, we've got a switch, locate it on your keyboard if you have one and you can switch it off and then you can switch it back on as well. Depending upon your keyboard, it may go and have physical batteries you can take in and out. If so, you can take them out and put them back in to restart it as well. Go and see if that solves the problem. The next thing you can try doing is if your keyboard uses a USB receiver, what you want to do is try unplugging it from your computer and you can plug it into a different USB port. That can often go and solve the problem. The next thing you can try doing is on your computer itself. So what you want to do is go and right click on the Windows button at the bottom and you can go and find Device Manager. In here, you need to go and find keyboards. So if we go and come down, you'll go and see it here, press the arrow to the left, and you'll go and see HID keyboard device. What you need to do is go and right click and go and click uninstall device like so, and go and confirm your decision. If you've got multiple, just go and repeat that. After you've done that, you now need to restart your computer. You can press the Windows Start button at the bottom, press the Power button and press Restart. Go and see if that solves the problem. If it does, then great. If it still doesn't, what you can try doing is connecting your keyboard differently. A lot of wireless keyboards are going to allow for also using a Bluetooth connection. If you're currently connecting with the receiver, try using Bluetooth. Click on the start button at the bottom and open up your settings. Click on Bluetooth and services to the left and click on add device to the right. Then select Bluetooth. You need to put your keyboard into pairing mode. On this keyboard here, I can choose a connection and then tap and hold. I'll use three for example. When it starts flashing, it should then appear on my computer. I can click on it and connect. It's now ready to go and that should have fixed it. If you found this useful, then leave a like.